dozing. Oh, nuts. I lose enough in five cars. What do I want with seven? <laughs> Hey, where'd you get the cake? My old lady well, said. Yeah. 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 Look at the guys. Yeah. 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 Hey, look at the guys. Look at that. Hey, pipe yeah. down, pipe down. Yeah. Frank, why don't you come over here and join the kids, huh? Mm, no, do me out. Hey, I uh, right from home. Thanks, kid. A little later. You know, you're going to have plenty of time to catch up on your reading. Okay, all right. You've hit me right in my most vulnerable spot. What's that? What do you think it is? My gambling instincts. Hey, nine guys, that's too many. There's only 52 cars in the deck. Oh, nine times five, 45, seven left over. Get your toothpicks out. Uh, are we going to eat cake or are we going to play cards? Okay, go keep. Let's play poker. Watch it, Mac. What are you reading all the time for? I know it sounds kind of silly, but I like it. Every time I read, I get a headache. Except pictures. Pictures I can look at all day long. I've had my share of books, too. Work like hell to get through high school. Just one more year to go. And I wind up here. So where did you expect to go? To college? Yeah. Ain't it funny? Well, I had to start work when I was 14. I bet. Grace, you got me by two years, Harry. Well, they ought to be moving us pretty soon. Yeah, but where? Anywhere, just as long as it ain't too far from the chow line. Well, I hope it isn't too soon. I met a wonderful girl just this morning. Well, as for me, I'd just like to go anywhere if they'd just give me an engine. I wonder if we'll get sea duty. Sure, just walk right up and ask the Admiral. Where'd you like to be assigned, Joey? Uh, I raise. South Sea. Hula girls. Da, 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 da. That's all, boys. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Look, I won that pot. How about those toothpicks? Fellas, he wants his toothpicks. No way. Give it to him. Hey, look, Fink, you better give her the hand this time. Fink, you know what I'm saying. You're good. I can use some help. Matter of fact, I feel kind of hot. I want some more toothpicks. Here I am, a guy who loves engines. So where do they put me? Oh, there he gives again with the engines. I've got a right to beef, or don't I? No, oh, I guess that guy's got a right to beef. Uh, him with the books and you with the engines. i never seen such a guy with the books. Yeah, every time he gets a chance. Yeah, when he's not going to classes. Well, I know what that'll get him. A headache like me. To have a headache, you got to first have a head. Oh! You know, there's something about an engine. Uh, maybe you guys don't understand that. I was a grease monkey in a gas station. Why, in my spare time, it was fun just to take an engine apart and put it together again. They'd only give me a chance to work at it. Why, they got guys right now down there in the engine room that don't know a camshaft from a, from a hole in the ground. They're down there and... And me, I'm on the gun crew. No rating, no nothing. Well, with me, it's different. I got two kids. Yeah. Where do I wind up? In the Navy, fighting a war. What for? I don't know. I was just thinking about those kids. They're home now. It's nearly eight bells. They're getting ready for bed. When I get home from working at the ice plant, well, I eat supper, and I play with them a little while. Give him a piggyback to bed. It's funny, ain't it? Me here. And then there. Oh, well, what'll it be? Bridge, pinochle, deuces wild, stud. What do you want to play? something for me? Well, sure, kid. What is it? William, 
write a letter for me? Well, I do what? Letter, will you? Write a letter for me. Well, you can write, can't you? Yeah, I can write, but I can't answer my girl's letter. Some of the things she writes, I don't even understand. And... I wouldn't worry about that, kid. You know how women are. Yeah, but she's smart. She's got brains, class. Well, she's not really my girl. I, I only met her the day before we shipped out. Somehow I got a funny feeling. A feeling that she's a girl I want to marry when I get back. I don't want her to think I'm a jerk. Okay, kid. I'll write your letter for you. Well, she may find out about it. Well, if that happens, I'll just have to figure out something else. By the way, you know there's no reason why you couldn't write this letter for yourself. All right, Frank, I didn't ask for advice. I'm not giving you advice, kid. It's just that you characters are in this mess together. Come let's see the letter. There's scuttlebutt we're shoving off this lousy island. Yeah, tomorrow. That's what they said yesterday. I wouldn't mind it a bit. They'd just give me an engine. Oh, you and your lousy engines. I worked for years trying to get a start in the trucking business. Trucking business? I was in the trucking business. No kidding. Where? All through the Middle West. Hey, your own trucks? No, somebody else's trucks. Uh, yeah. That's how it is with guys like us. Always working for somebody else. Always doing things for somebody else. Never thinking about doing things for ourselves. Hey, Eddie. Huh? How about it? How about what? Teaming up. You and me. Look, we didn't ask for this war, but we're in it, and we got to stay with it. But after, what do you say? We team up, get the best truck in business inside of Moline. Or we beat the rates, work like hell? What do you say? I say, yeah. Don't need to take more than two trucks. Maybe three the most. We beat time and pack truck better than anybody in the whole damn country. Yeah, and then when things are going good, we get a couple of more trucks. See, expand like. Then we get a couple more guys and they drive with us. Yeah. Yeah, no. What's the matter? What's the matter? No dough. You mean you trucked all those years and you got no dough at all? Nary a dime. Great. There goes the trucking business. You want to go into business, eh? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. We want to talk about borrowing some money on the GI Bill of Rights. Well, just when did you want to go into business? Well, not now, sir. For after the war. Oh, I see. Well, when the time comes, the first thing you'll have to do... Well, have you had enough? <clears throat> Hope I think I'll have another one. Another one? You're sure you want another one? Mm-hmm. Sure. Okay, by me. How does it feel, being back? Did, uh, you get my letters? If we wanted them. Oh, Peter, they were so wonderful. They were so like you. What's wrong? Nothing. Dear Miss Jewel. Miss Jewel, what? You know, it's funny, funny how much you can miss a person, even if you just known him for a day. It's funny. I missed you, too. All the time I was out there, I kept thinking and thinking. I... Thinking? What about? About you. Me. Your letters told me all about that. One my letters. I got some other guy to write them for me. Peter. Oh, I thought about you so much, I couldn't help it. I'm not up to the things you write about. I never learned about those things. I, I, 
seems I don't know anything. Don't be silly. Well, then, don't mention those letters, huh? <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, nothing. Look, I don't feel much like dancing. Let's get out of here, huh? Dance. Yeah, I know. I used to like a lot of things. I don't anymore. What's happened? Oh, forget it. No, I, I'd like to know. What's the difference how I feel? Makes a lot of difference to me. I don't understand you, Lou. When it's all over, you'll be back. And the high school will still be here. Yeah, but you can deal me out. I thought you wanted to finish and go on to college. Go to college? That's good. Look, when I get back, I won't be 18 anymore. I'll be older, lots older. I'm not going to go back to school with a bunch of kids that were wiping milk off their chins while I was out there pitching. What difference does it make? Can't you see the difference? No. I can't see any difference. Come here, let's have a little talk about this. Did you hear what your mother said? She said I'm spoiling you. What do you think about that, huh? Oh, no, Dad. No! I don't know. Well, maybe I am spoiling you. Well, that's all right. When I go away, why, she can fix you up again so I can come back and spoil you all over again. <laughs> hey, look what time it's getting to be. Come on, we got to get going here. Let's, let's get a piggyback here. Come on. That's it. Up. We go and away. <laughs> Come on, here we go. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna have a better world to live in than we had. There won't be any more of this. You think so, Harry? to it. You, me. I guess there's nothing that people like us can do about it. I hear tell the war is over. So why the hell are we heading west instead of east? Sure, the war is over. I know a guy got out. I know a guy got out last year. No kid. He's back to his peacetime job, sleeping home nights. Is she nice? What happens now? Anybody know? Oh, look, a lot of guys have had it tougher. A lot of guys out there haven't even been home one night. Yeah, the chief was telling us we still got a job to do, patrolling Jap waters, getting guys off Pacific Bay. Why the hell should it be us? Hiya, fellas. What? Where are you going? I'm leaving. Sure, sure. Would you like us to call you a cab? What's the gas? They dropped me off at Pearl Harbor in the morning. I, I'm going to fleet school. Well, how, how'd that happen? Well, I applied for it. I guess getting my high school diploma sort of helped. High school diploma? Hey, you mean all that studying you've been doing there? Mm -hmm. You're going to be an admiral, huh? No, but when I get through school, I'll be in line for first class. Don't you expect to get out of the Navy? What good will all that advanced training be then? I don't know. Might help me to get a better job. Gee, that's swell. Hey, these books you've been reading, they, they got all the answers, huh? Maybe, Harry. Maybe. Um, keep an eye on my stuff, will you? I'm going topside. Oh, yeah, sure.
We went to the bank to see the guy about lending money to go in the trucking business. Sure, he says, we'll lend you the money. The government will guarantee half. But what do you know about transportation, he says? Commercial and interstate law. Legal procedure for freighting. I said, look, mister, we didn't come here to go to college. We come here to get dough. The guy was right, Eddie. Maybe. You want to go to college? Well, maybe I do. You could learn about engines. Who the hell wants to learn about engines? Me. Where are you going, Harry? Topside. your problem? Well, is this where you learn? Yes, I'm educational services officer. You learn about anything here? Well, most anything. I mean, you learn about getting diplomas and, and the trucking business and all about engines? Oh, yes. You want to learn about all those things? <laughs> oh, no, sir. No, I was thinking about a lot of other guys. All right, now let's talk about you. Well, on my last leave, my wife and I, we got to talking things over about fighting for a better world. Well, I was thinking about my kids. They've got to have a better world. So, well, what I want to know is, how can we get that world? And if that's possible, what can a fellow like me do about it? Well, lots of us are asking that same question. Nobody has the complete answer. But there are things we can do about it. Such as what, sir? Training for citizenship. Studying public issues knowing how to make your vote count. That's orientation. We have a class starting next week. And if you look over these pamphlets, you'll be better prepared to take part in the discussions. What's the matter, Joe? Did you give out a win? Yeah. Make with the music, Joe. Listen to him. I gotta make with the music yet. Suppose I don't feel like making with the music. You know, I can stand a couple of beers. Shut up. That's my trucking partner. All he's got in his mind is beer. Yeah, yeah, well, what do you got in your mind? Well, it ain't beer. Well, Frank will be on terra firma soon. Terra firma? What's that? Dry land, jerk. Well, why did you say so, jerk? Oh, don't mind him. He's got to be fancy. College boy. You know damn well I never got to go to college. So what are you getting sore about? I never got trucks either. Yeah, and how about the oh, guy... Oh, dry up, will you? Let a guy read a letter? Oh, learn to write a letter first. Oh, oh easy, take it easy. easy. Take it easy, fellas. Go on, kid. Take a poke at me. Go on, make you feel better. Geez, I could sure use a couple beers. Uh, what's doing on deck, Harry? Oh, a lot of circulation here. Well, what'll it be, a stud of draw? No, not planned. What do you got there, a book? Yeah? You know, another educated character. Oh, no, no, I'm not educated yet, but I'm going to be. Why? So you can show us up like Frankie did? Look, is this what you want the rest of your life? Go on, take them. Well, maybe we don't want them. All right, then get a book. My old man couldn't make me read a book. My teacher couldn't make me read a book. Now you're going to try. I don't give a damn if you never read a book. Sure, we're smart guys. What the hell do we care? We don't have to know anything. We don't have to learn. Do we? The guy's nuts. Now, what about your trucking business, Eddie? Why the hell don't you shut up? Yeah, I guess I've been sounding off. Yeah, you've been sounding off. You know, I've been thinking... Ah, oh, shut up, Eddie. Now, where are you going? I'm, uh... I'm gonna get shorty.
Well, I'm going topside. Want to blow? Nope. Pictures. What kind of pictures? Engines. Any pictures of diplomas, Joe? Sir. Yes? Oh, wait a minute. What's on your mind? Oh, well, well sir. Well, I've been standing out there quite a while trying to make up my mind to come in and... Well, it was, it was something that, uh, well, if you had a little time and it wasn't too much trouble, I... Excuse me, sir. Shorty and I had sort of a little deal on. He come up here without me. We're still partners, ain't we? We'd, We'd like, like to learn, learn about, about the... The trucking business. <laughs> <laughs> it isn't easy. The first step isn't easy. But it's a lot easier for a guy who can stand on his own two feet and climb that ladder, step by step. To write that letter. To get to know those engines. To get a rating. Go places. Get that diploma. And there's only one thing...